Welcome to Allenby in West Cumbria. We are on Hadrian Cycleway National Route 72. We completed the project a few weeks ago and we are welcoming cyclists and pedestrians to, to come and test out the new path. Allerdale has a fantastic cycling network particularly on this stretch of cycleway where we have a lot of flat areas off-road which enables people to cycle comfortably and freely and safely with some fantastic areas of visibility across the Solway. We've got the long distance cycling route all the way from the northeast uh, down to Ravenglass but it's also perfect for, for families on a, on a day out. I think one of the great things about the new development of the cycleway from Allenby to Sillith is it offers people visiting the area much more choice now. Uh, in the past a lot of our customers really used very well indeed the cycleway from Allenby to Maryport but they didn't have much of an option especially for family groups to go north. I think Allenby is one of uh, West Cumbria's best kept secrets. Everyone thinks about the Lake District when they think about Cumbria and they don't really know about the Solway Plain and the area of outstanding natural beauty. We have the best sunsets in the world. We've got all sorts of you know, designated sites, um, SSSI and SAC and you know, internationally famous sites. So being able to experience them at a kind of like a bit of a slower pace, you know, it's really special. As a village that has many, many local visitors that come by car, it's really brilliant to see this cycleway opening up and extending because it's encouraging more and more people to leave their cars at home and actually come to the village by bike, which is actually changing the village. It's making it a much more pleasant place. Now with the cycleway opening up to the north, this is gonna bring the businesses on that part of the route into play. And then when people get up to Sillith, there's a whole variety of things to do in Sillith on the green, uh, lovely area for picnics, uh, there's an amusement arcade, there's pubs, there's fish and chip shops, there's cafes. It's also a really tranquil landscape, so um, as you, you, you're out on your walk or your cycle ride, you often do come across um, little kind of ex close encounters with wildlife um, and beautiful places as well. So, um, you know, getting out of your car and being out in the landscape is a really good way to have those lovely wildlife experiences in a fairly quiet but also really beautiful landscape. I think it's great um, and hopefully it'll attract more visitors to use these areas which will help the economy up and down the coast. It's unspoiled, it's a beautiful, beautiful area.